Some neighbors are on edge tonight after more than two dozen cars were broken into at their apartment complex. It's been happening for several weeks at the Cypress Creek Apartments on Reed Road in Southeast Houston. Channel 2's Jonathan Martinez live for us tonight. And Jonathan, people who live in that complex are just fed up, we understand. Yeah, they really are, Sarah. Several residents here really worried after dozens and dozens of car break ins. In fact, a lot of them are left with hundreds of dollars in repair bills. They just want these criminals to be caught. The sounds of window repair men now a familiar one for residents at the Cypress Creek Apartments after criminals have repeatedly targeted and terrorized the complex. Windows broken out, consoles uh, 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 broken into. I've been here two years. I've never seen anything like this. Keisha Pickering had her car broken into five times in the recent weeks and even had her wallet stolen. And she's not alone. We have people who aren't able to make it to work. We have people whose kids can't get in the vehicles because they're shattered glass. Neighbors say over 30 vehicles like these, now sporting sheets to cover busted windows, were broken into overnight. However, they also say dozens of other cars were also hit here at least four other times this month and at surrounding complexes. And we need this to be out there because whoever's doing this here needs to be stopped. There are surveillance cameras set up across the property, but so far, no leads. Apartment management tells us they sent out a notice about the crimes and are working to speak with every resident. They're also working to hire security, including off duty HPD officers, to patrol the complex. They're, they're cowards and, and, and why are they doing this? I just don't understand why they keep doing it. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. You know, go get a job, find something to do. And the complex tells us they are working with HPD. HPD tells us they are aware of the cases but aren't sure on the exact number just yet. They are urging anyone with information to contact Crime Stoppers. We are reporting live tonight from Southeast Houston. I'm Jonathan Martinez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.